With a budget of eight hundred thousand to nine hundred thousand dollars, what kind of condo can we get in North York, Toronto? Hi, my name is Priscilla. I'm your real estate broker in the Greater Toronto area. Today, my client is a young couple looking for an investment property. Last week, we saw some choices in downtown Toronto, and now we are going to see some condos in North York. Before looking at the property, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss my weekly real estate knowledge sharing and some wonderful virtual tours. See you later. Once entering this unit, on my left hand, I see a closet with two sliding doors, and on my right, there is a U-shaped kitchen. It has been upgraded. As you can see, the countertop material is coarse, and these kitchen appliances and cabinets look quite new too. The good thing about older condos is that, in general, they are more spacious and have a good layout. Here's the dining area to put a big table, and then that is the large entertainment area. It's pretty wide, and the distance to watch TV is ideal from the sofa. Let's go to see the bedrooms. Here is the first one. You can see this room has a big floor-to-ceiling window, and it makes this room very bright. The size of this room is about 75 square feet. Here's a large corner balcony. That is the highlight of this property because plenty of sunshine makes the room bright and spacious. Opposite to this bedroom, there is a laundry room with a stacked washer and dryer. One shared washroom is next to it. This washroom has a shower instead of a bathtub. Next, let's have a look at the master bedroom. This bedroom is also the highlight of this property, a corner unit. You can see plenty of lights come in from two directions. And this room is about 18 square feet, spacious enough for a king size bed, two nightstands, and extra space to put a reading table or a dressing desk. And then this bedroom has a full four pieces bathroom, which has both a shower and a bathtub. We can have another look at this master bedroom from this angle. I had a listing before in the same building, the same layout as this unit, so I have a very good understanding of its highlight, the corner balcony. Look. The street under the building is the famous Yang Street, and you can see how long and wide this balcony is. So it makes this unit really bright. So if you like big windows and urban life, this property would be a good choice for you. By the way, it's within walking distance to the subway station. That's it. Let's have a last look at the main living area, from entrance to kitchen. Living room and then a wraparound corner balcony. This is the end of today's video. If you are interested in any property type, neighborhood, or price range, please feel welcome to talk to me. I'll be more than happy to arrange showings or take virtual tour videos for you. My service is one hundred percent free. See you in next video.